Okay, in this video, let's take a look at Victor Hovland's golf swing. Great young player out of Oklahoma State, and he and his teammate, or former teammate, Matt Wolf, destined to make a huge impact on the PGA Tour. I love his golf swing for a couple reasons. Number one, because he's such an accurate player, the way he keeps the club face square or shut on the backswing like Dustin Johnson, and then comes through and keeps it square through impact. Also, because he makes such a great rotational move at the golf ball. As you watch these full motion pictures here, he simply turns back and turns through. There's no lateral shifting like we taught in the old days. And true to form with a lot of the new players today, a nice bowed left wrist at the top or flat for some players, strong club face, and that allows him to come through impact, keeping the face very square. Once again, with the body motion from here, hips turning in the barrel, no sway, gets behind the ball nicely without swaying, then turns back through. Nice square club face that we'll look at more here in a minute and just rotates like crazy all the way to the finish. Chest turning well to the left. As he comes in here, this still frame showing the face already square to the plane, looking a little bit closed. And as he does that, that allows him to keep the face square coming through impact well beyond the strike. Full motion, we can see that bowing of the wrist as it comes in. And as the club goes through, you can even see the face with the naked eye staying square a long way down the target line, which is really cool to see. If you're more of a close-up, you can see that face very square well after the strike, which will make him an extremely accurate driver of the golf ball and a very accurate iron player. So there's his buddy Matt Wolf over there on the other screen to the left. And we'll take a look at his swing as well in this video because it's good to know these, these two players will be linked together for a long time, I'm sure, because of their college days. As he goes back here, very different golf swing in terms of fundamentals. He has a, more of a, a weak grip, but as he takes the club back, inverted like I'm sure most of you have seen on the other videos. But the left wrist, wrist will bow down and get into a square position here in a minute. Also turning in the barrel, no shifting, no sway. As he starts it down, like a lot of the George Gankus players, putting pressure directly in the ground, turning the hips in a circle, no sway whatsoever. Here comes that bowing of the left wrist right there, very similar to Victor Hovland's, but because his grip is a little weaker, you'll see a little more face rotation as he comes through. Not, it's not rotating fast, however, so you can see the club very stable through the strike zone at the bottom. And then as he comes in, the face is turning over more than Victor Hovland's, but still very minor relative to a lot of the players of, throughout history. Amazing ball striker, amazing movements, as you know, watching his swing, with all the forward pressing, etc. But you can see why he's consistent, how he creates such a tremendous amount of force, his club head speed. And it will be a blast to watch he and Victor Hovland going forward to see who has a better career. But with both of these swings, you can see the consistency built in. And I can't wait to see what happens for the future of the tour.